The reason Adam and Eve sinned was because they thought there was something else. Because there was something else in, in their eyes that they wanted more than what God had said was truly for them, that he had blessed them and given them everything that they needed. And they bought into it. They worshipped that idol because they doubted the goodness of God. They doubted that God really had taken care of them and provided everything that they needed because the serpent said there was something else I didn't have. There was something else out there, and that something else began to whisper in Eve's ear. And here she began to eat the fruit, and then she handed it to her husband Adam, who was with her. And both of them experiencing the goodness of God, seeing creation, seeing all of this newness, Adam Adam, seeing this woman created, I mean, my goodness, all of this wonder that God had just shown how amazing he is and how much he cares for them and how he had given them everything they needed. But then the lie of you don't have it all. You need something else. God's holding back on you. God's really not everything you need. And he hasn't really given you everything you need. And, and when they hear that message in their ears... They begin to go, hmm, there's more. I want something else other than what God's already given, what he's already provided. And they were doubting the goodness of God. You see, I think the enemy will promise a better life than you've already been given. He'll promise you all sorts of things that provide something for you that maybe you feel that you deserve, that you feel you're entitled to. And we'll buy into it. We'll begin to worship those idols, but it is a lie. And it's a lie aimed at getting you to worship, but it's promising on things that cannot deliver. 